First off, it's a great result for APC because being assessed at the second lowest level of assessment is reflective of the amount of work and the quality of the work that we've done on the project over the last two years. Importantly also, it gives our project team a defined timeline with which, uh, within which the EPA will consider our assessment. They'll commit to a time frame for us, so long as we can continue to provide any information that's required. And finally, it fits well within the development timeline that we'd been working to ourselves. So really, overall, a very good outcome for APC. First half 2018 is going to be an exciting uh, half for us uh, here at APC. Out at Lake Wells on the, on the Potash project, we'll be looking to continue our long-term pump testing program. Uh, we'll look to install a further two test production wells, which will take us to a total installed capacity of about 20% of the stage one bore field. Uh, but overarching all of that is that we'll be producing our own trade samples of SOP for the first time. It's with those trade samples that we go back to China and continue the conversation with our MOU Chinese offtake partners, looking to formalise those, formalise those offtake agreements. So a pretty exciting half for, for APC. After we got the, the second of the CSA reports back towards the end of last year, uh, we've now put together a comprehensive 23,000 metre drill program on the highest priority target out at uh, Yamana. And we would expect to be drilling that through uh, towards the end of the first quarter and, and through the second quarter of uh, 2018. Ultimately, uh, we would look to be talking about the numbers and the assay results we get out of that first program in the second quarter of 2018. The board are certainly considering whether or not the market is, is uh, reflecting the value that we believe is inherent in the Yamana Gold project and the Potash project. We probably don't think it is, so uh, we, we think one of the better alternatives for, for us at the moment and for our shareholders in particular is to divest ourselves of that project one way or another. Uh, we will be looking on the back of the assay results we get from this first program of drilling. We'll be looking to make a decision as to how we proceed and, and crystallise the value for our shareholders towards the middle of 2018.